Okay, in this video, I'm going to talk about when a, a person who's, some would say, narcissistic, um, learns something new. You might hear it from somebody else, or watch a TV show, see it on there, wherever, it doesn't matter. They, they learn something new, and it's not something they've ever known before, they've never been interested in before, maybe a little bit of it, whatever, and suddenly they feel like they're, you know, they know all there is to know about it. Okay. And, um, I was thinking about this earlier today, and, and when they, once they become this so-called, you know, self-proclaimed expert on something, they look at you as though, you know, if you don't know, if they ask you a question, they look at you and they, and you don't know the answer because it's not something you were recently studied or whatever. And um, they'll, they'll act as though you're really stupid, okay? You're an idiot, you're not educated, you're whatever. And they, they do that. They, I've actually seen more than one do that. And it's, it's kind of funny, you know, they just now learn it themselves. And you are wrong because you didn't know it. Okay, pardon the blinkers. Anyway, um... And I was thinking about that, like I said, earlier today, and then a, a little earlier today, well, a little after that, actually, yeah, a little after that, Adam was watching a TV show, not a TV show, a movie on TV, on cable, about um, President Lincoln, okay, about Lincoln, I think that's the name of it, isn't it? And all of a sudden, he, I was in another room. And after watching it for a while, he said, he asked me, what is the 13th Amendment? <laughs> it made me, it, I had been thinking about this while he was watching it. And I was in another room, I could hear it. And it kind of made me laugh. I said, I don't know. Well, I didn't say I don't know. Okay, I said, uh, you're watching it, you tell me. <laughs> and the reason I said it was because it was on my mind that, you know, people will, We'll do that. Just what I just all said during all this video. And if you an you answer, well, I don't really remember, or I don't know, or even if you answer, they're going to find a way to say that you're wrong, that they know more. You know, somehow, some way. People who are narcissistic, in my experience, my experience is also like more like histrionic too. Um, they love to tell people they're wrong. They find so many creative ways to tell the other person they're wrong and that they know more unbelievable sometimes back to back never anything any different anytime you speak you're wrong and they they know more or they're better and I've said this I don't know how many times yeah okay now that I thought was kind of funny but I really I just put up a video that I made um, earlier today actually when I was hadn't had my morning caffeine and um, it was about that, you know, there's so much information out about the same kind of thing on, you, you know, just not on YouTube, just out there about how bad narcissistic people are. And um, some just, some flat out say they have the personality disorder, unless you know that they've been diagnosed by a professional. Anyway, I wouldn't say that, but um, there's so much information about how bad they are. That I, in that video I mentioned, we need to move on. P yes, sure, pe there's so much information. People can look and find it and all that. But what about moving on and finding um, more of, like I said in that video, how they can be penalized for their their behaviors? That, I think, is important. Okay, I want to mention that. Okay, but what about also about therapy for them, counseling? And I know a lot of people have heard a million times. I think I may have even suggested that I don't think that they ever change, but I, that's because I think I even said that I've never known any of them to. Okay, the, but that's that's not saying none of them change. But I think a lot of people, they see things in that all or nothing, none, all or none kind of way, and this, they put a period right there. There's no uh, shades of gray for them, but you know, it's black or white, no shades of gray. So anyway, I, I do remember, I have a book somewhere at home, 
on my bookshelf with all my other books, psychology, sociology, all those, plus and then some. Um, I think it was about schema therapy. And it was supposed to be for people who, you know, one kind of therapy for people who are narcissistic. I think it's for people who are diagnosed with narcissistic personality disorder. I don't know. Um, I have it somewhere, like I said, I, I don't know when I bought it. It was a while back. Since I've been making videos on it, I found it and I bought it. But I never finished reading it. It was a used book. And I don't remember who it was. It seemed scholarly, but I, I didn't read enough into it. In it, um, But it seemed very... There's so much in it to be discussed, really. To t think about, to be um, picked apart and thought about and talked about and all that. Where was I? But where was I? <laughs> Somebody answer me. No, anyway. I think I was talking about that book. And I've read bits and pieces of it. And I could see that it's a book that would take time to sit there and really go over each, I don't know what you would even call them, um, each section maybe or something. It was, it was so deep, so very deep. <laughs> but it seems very scholarly to me. Like I said, I, I don't, I'm not certain. I can't say that 100%. But, I mean, I know a lot of people want to stick to certain types that they've heard all over these years. You know, what anybody should have this one, that one. It's not a one-size-fits-all kind of thing. How many times do I say that? <laughs> really, if I had a penny for every time I said that. But, I think it's something interesting to look into. I think it's something that I would love to hear other people's views on, you know, different parts of it. Myself, I'm not telling anybody what to do and... Like I said, I'm, I don't know. I'm not certain about it, how I feel about it. It, it would take a lot to sit there and read and um, go through each one. All right, and another thing is I think that some people are, might be, I don't know, might be concerned. I don't know if anybody that, anyway that is, that if you even suggest something like a, um, you know, a true narcissist, somebody who's actually been diagnosed, that, or even for some people, if, if somebody has the behaviors or some behaviors or one behavior that's narcissistic. And some people believe that if you say, that, well, they could change it, that the people who need to leave won't leave. Okay, whatever anybody does or doesn't do, that's on them. They pay the consequences of their own actions and inactions. And I do not think anybody should be giving anybody advice. Um, like over a video or just in on a post or something like that or a reply or comment You know to tell somebody to leave or not to leave. that that ooh, did you see that truck? He almost hurt us all but Yeah, you know, I don't, I don't think anybody should t throw me off there a second but really and some people do. They'll say, well, you must leave. There are so many consequences, so many things that could happen for if somebody just decided, oh, I better leave because somebody told me to. You know, that could be, I think, is considered the most dangerous time for somebody. And that's not to tell anybody to not leave. That's not to tell any, that's not saying to not leave. That's not saying to leave. Neither way. Nobody should give you the advice that's just online and you, you know, somebody just decides to tell you that. That's how I see it. But I think that some people would think that, yeah, you know, if you say that, then some people say, oh, I can change him or I can change her. You know, if I just give him enough love or, give, you know, I think we've all heard that many times. Enough love or attention or with this or that. Leave it to the professionals, you know, really. I think that, I'm not giving them any counseling advice. Read the disclaimer. But to me, that's what I say, you know. This is something that it needs professional, a professional counselor or whatever it is where you live, that they make these uh, decisions. They counsel them. People want to just take on counseling. Something that bad that can be potentially extremely bad. Okay, as though they're because they're in the situation, they can fix it. Not good, in my opinion. Okay, and I'm not asking any, I, I, I wouldn't even think anybody should speak on something 
like read that book and or parts of that book and say I know 100% what this means and only my way of viewing it is right any book anything any thought about it I'm not suggesting that at all but it's, it's you know if they state there's a difference in when you state this is my opinion or you have it in your disclaimer these are my opinions I could be wrong you know but some people will, will put it out there as though they and they only know okay when you're a in the field you know that like like I said that not one therapy kinds of therapy one therapy fits all like it does not happen and that's something that you learn that you your way is not always the right way for everybody and it's not always the the right way that what the <laughs> yeah, you saw that it was bugging me you never know okay I just hope I make it there alive tonight. oh my goodness really no? but anyway I hope all this made some some sort of sense um, I, I don't know if I mentioned it but this morning when I made that video um, I made a video about this I mentioned that I didn't have enough caffeine. Well, during the day, I fell asleep, took a long nap, and I feel, still feel kind of, what is the word, groggy? People use groggy, and not not really. I'm, I'm awake, but I'm more like just kind of a little tired. <laughs> Maybe, I, yeah, a little tired, that would be it. So, anyway, yeah, that was a little tired too. So I'm going to wrap this video up, and um, but if you have a comment, any comment about it, or if you have any concern or worry about it, like somebody might take it upon themselves to say that they're the self-proclaimed expert on the whole topic, leave a comment below. Okay. Or if you think it's good, bad, whatever, leave a comment below. I'll talk to you on another video.